Vandenberg test for bilirubin. It is a specific test for identification of increased serum bilirubin levels. Mechanism of reaction. The Vandenberg reagent is diazotized sulfanilic acid or otherwise called as diazo reagent. So, bilirubin reacts with this diazo reagent or diazotized sulfanilic acid to produce a colored azo pigment. Now, this pigment at pH 5 is purple in color. How to interpret this Vandenberg test? If conjugated bilirubin reacts with this Vandenberg reagent, be it being water soluble, it gives directly the color. So that is why it is called as direct reaction. When conjugated bilirubin reacts with Vandenberg solution, purple color is immediately seen. So that is why it is called as direct reaction. Now why it is immediately seen? Because conjugated bilirubin is water soluble. And next, if unconjugated bilirubin reacts with Vandenberg reagent, because unconjugated bilirubin is water insoluble, the first thing to be done is it has to be extracted first with alcohol. And then uh, it uh, when it reacts with the reagent, it, the reaction becomes positive. That is the purple color is seen. So that is why it is called as indirect reaction. So, unconjugated bilirubin, the purple color is seen only after the extraction of uh, alcohol because it is water insoluble. Whereas, if, if the serum contains both conjugated and unconjugated uh, bilirubin, the purple color is developed immediately which is direct positive and it also develops after the addition of alcohol that is the purple color is intensified it becomes much darker when alcohol is added to it so because it uh, the purple color is seen at the both the stages it is called as biphasic reaction so if there is only conjugated bilirubin it is called as direct positive and if there is unconjugated bilirubin, it is called as indirect positive. And if the serum has both conjugated and unconjugated bilirubin, it is called as biphasic reaction.